Welcome back viewers of the outside world. So today we are um, playing Breath of the Wild. We just got out of the Great Plateau and now it's introducing me to all these EX quests. But currently, I believe we're heading to seek out Impa. Because Impa leads us to um, all of the divine beasts. I think there's something in these ruins. So I'm just gonna scan the area with magnesis. Um, but I don't think there is anything. Uh, yeah, I don't sense anything with magnesis. So, just. Yep. All right. Um. So there's nothing in these ruins. I don't think. Oh, there's Bach album. I'm gonna find. All right, so um, I just equipped a new sword, and we still his. All right, there we go. Let's see what we get from inside this chest. Twenty dollars or twenty rupees, I should say. All right, so now that we have gone through that, um, we can start heading towards Impa. And Impa lives in Kakarko Village, I believe is how you pronounce that. Um, Legend of Zelda tends to have very strange names four places. Oh, they have mops and hoes of the sort. So I'm just going to change my weapon to the iron sledgehammer and swing it around. See, that was fun. Um, no, I don't want that. Oh, yes. Oh. I think this is like a really powerful weapon that he's holding. Yeah, farming hoe. Um, I'm definitely going to get rid of this rusty broadsword. And then I'm also going to get rid of this Bach Album Club and with wood mop because I like spears. I can't wait until I get a horse. Oh, here's some dragonflies. Is there, oh. What do you want? Oh, there's a shrine. Um, I do not know how I didn't see that. Um, well, along my journey, I'm I'm only gonna get shrines that I see. Like I'll do in a different series, Breath of the Wild. Um, getting all 120 shrines, um, but in this playthrough, I'm just gonna clear every shrine that I see. Um, 
Maybe in some cases I'll backtrack to certain shrines that have like good armor or of the sort or something. But for right now, I'm just gonna do shrines that I see. That was an easy chest to get. We made it there. Um, this is a very fast shrine. Uh, one of the simpler ones. Some of them, like, you seriously need to um, look at the guide for or a guide online or something. No! I barely didn't make it. Um, because, like, they have you put in certain patterns that you wouldn't that um like you have to know a certain thing in order to like actually get correct all right so we finally made to this chest and it was extremely worth it um having some kind of extremely powerful weapon soldiers play more um so I'm glad I took the time and effort to grab that weapon. And here we are with another spirit orb. Got our spirit orb. And now back on track um as i was saying um or at least i believe i was saying i can't wait until i get a horse in this game because horses are very useful for traveling um the best horse in the game is opona obviously but that's only be um you can only get opona by using amiibos um but different horses have like different stats like stamina um and like um speed and different things like that um also there are these like there's normal size horses and there's like ginormous horses that only appear in certain areas and they usually have really good um stats but they're hard to find let's get these drumsticks okay well, i'm gonna throw this wooden mop it was very fragile and then i'll just take this wooden sword Okay. Hoping, because if I take the watcher or whatever you want to call him out, then I can maybe sneak by and kill the others easily. I'm hoping this tree will protect him from seeing me. Ah, he saw me. Okay, I guess he didn't. Um, that was very surprising. And then I, oh, they just fell asleep. What luck. Oh, I see a book of that. Still don't see me. Oh, 
Oh, they saw me. Or they heard me. Wait, let me stealth strike this one. Oh, dang. Oh, wow. He's gonna throw a rock at me. There we go. Well, actually, I'm gonna. I threw that travel sword many times, so I do. I do believe that it is probably damaged. I wish there was like a feature in Breath of the Wild where you like got to see it's like what durability your weapon had. So, like, because, like, I know it warns you, like, when it says, um, such and such is, your such and such is badly damaged, but, like, I wish it, like, told you, like, the exact amount of durability it had, like, whenever you wanted. That would be a nice feature, in my opinion. Um, I probably will spend the rest of this episode um, going and um, finding Impa. Well, I know exactly where Impa is, but the journey there is brutal. There's go. Okay, Link. If you don't know what raw meat is, you have some problems. Like, I know you forgot a lot in your slumber, but just still. Uh, so Kakariko Village is on the other side of that mountain, which means we need to do some climbing. gentlemen I don't really know what to talk about right now um well um I guess we could talk about if I'm gonna make it no oh no. well now I can Barely, but I did. Um, that extra stam stamina um, part actually really helped. I'm hopeful that I can make it up this mountain. I think should be able to make it. Yep, there we go. Um, I just glide over here, and we only got one more to go. You can make it. You can make it. Yeah! Oh, Guardian. Guardians. Oh, God, it's see me. Oh. Well, that was brutal. Well, that's our first death of the, the game. Oh, 
Oh, we have to start all the way back here. Okay, that's not fun. Um, I'm gonna get the tower because I know there's like a certain road you can take. I just don't know where it is. But if I get the tower, then I know exactly where it is. So, instead of spending the next four-ish minutes that we have climbing, we can get the tower and then easily make it to Impa next episode. Okay. We got that. And this is the Dueling Peaks Tower. I don't even care about these Bok Goblins. Um, I'm gonna climb this rock here. Oh, barely made that. All right. Nice. Um, so we've made it to the Dueling Peaks Tower and that gives us the map of the area. And I'm, I actually am planning to get all the towers too because having a full map of the area is very useful. It's more useful than it might seem. Like, there are some mountains that you can only climb even with, like, a full stamina wheel and still need, like, stamina, like, elixirs and things that help you, like, either give you more stamina or restore stamina. Look how small the Great Plateau region is compared to the Dueling Peaks. Oh, I didn't know we unlocked that now. Um, but we don't get the Shiga Sensor Plus until later in the game, which that is useful for finding parts, um, to upgrade your armor. Um, and it says there is a shrine nearby, which I do believe is somewhere around here. Um, I will probably be able to make it to the shrine, um, just not clear it. Uh, there it is. Um, but I do believe that this shrine has some climbing gear in it. Um, so I'm just going to activate it and then we can go in and clear it next time. Um, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please remember to like and subscribe and I'll see you all next time.